so in the defense path so we'll be uh, working on uh, again pre security uh, you guys know i don't want to repeat it again uh, web linux windows all fundamentals yeah yeah definitely fahad yeah, you can write uh, ch into it and in cyber defense uh, cyber defense introduction uh, threat and vulnerability management security operations and monitoring uh, threat emulsion incident response and forensics and malware analysis so we'll train you on all these topics in cyber defense and the tools we'll be using is open was nessus autopsy uh, for digital forensics we use autopsy yara wireshark for network sniffing uh, Rem uh, remnix and uh, we have windows system internals uh then uh moving forward in defense uh we have soc l1 uh, uh module so in that we'll be te te teaching you with cyber defense frameworks uh, threat intelligence uh, network security and traffic analysis endpoint security monitoring uh, security information and event management which is your scene where splunk uh, come into picture so digital forensics and incident response in detail and especially we have a module just for phishing attack so how to uh, track a phishing attack how to mitigate it so we have a specific module for phishing so again here kali linux nessus uh, autopsy splunk yara wireshark snort and wazoo so snort uh, like based on your configuration it can be working it can be uh, working as ids or ips system uh, ids is uh, Uh, intrusion detection system ips is intrusion prevention system so in soc l2 we'll be tra training you on log analysis uh, advanced splunk advanced elk detection engineering threat hunting threat emulsion incident response and malware analysis so again you will go splunk in detail elk in detail uh, aurora in detail uh, wireshark yara autopsy all the tools you would have seen in soc l1 but that is entry level uh, here you guys are going to work on case studies and how to work on logs and analyze analyze the logs using these tools so you can go for a splunk uh, once you are done with our uh, master program you, you get an additional guidance for taking splunk certificate like splunk uh, cyber security defense analyst so in network security path uh, we'll be training you on palo alto pc cet fundamentals of cyber security network security cloud security and soc environment so you guys will be getting all this four certificates directly from palo alto with a uh, zero cost uh, you don't have to pay anything extra for them so uh, nsc 1 2 and 3 which is fortinet certified fundamentals fortinet certified associate and these two certificates you will be getting from fortinet directly in we'll be training you on uh, nsc 4 uh, for security fabric how to uh, build a fabric uh, firewall policies how to develop a nat network firewall authentication logging monitoring certificate operations web filtering application control antivirus ids and ddos uh, mitigation ssl vpn uh, dial up ipsec vpn dlp Uh, routing uh, software defined wan which is your sd wan uh, virtual doms uh, layer 2 switching site to site ipsec vpn fsso uh, high availability uh, web proxy and diagnostics so we will be training you for uh, nsc4 certificates in nsc4 certification this all the topics we will be covering with you so in pcnsa which is uh, palo alto certified network security associate uh, defense uh, device management and services uh, managing objects policy evaluation and management security traffic so these are all the topics we will be covering and you will be awarded with the certificate once you are successfully completed any of this path like three paths which we have discussed so far so we have our capstone project where you will be implementing your uh, knowledge like in malware analysis soc monitoring exploiting a web application fortigate firewall master lock so 
where we can uh, you guys will be implementing uh, this is a scenario based so where you guys can uh, uh, like implement all the knowledge you gain from the master program and you can evaluate yourself and you can submit a report to us so fifth and sixth month we'll be helping you with uh, completing pending projects and certifications uh, internship project opportunity uh, with uh, a company uh, for the best performing student uh, building your uh, profile in linkedin creating a cv focused on cyber security uh, how to apply for a job how to uh, give you uh, a interview point of guidance and job guidance session we'll have which will be happening in the fifth and sixth month once you are successfully completing all your projects and everything so this is our ctf portal Uh, uh, this is our inbuilt uh, uh, CTF portal. Once you are done successfully completing the program, uh, I, I'll also show you guys uh, CTF portal uh, in live. So this is how it will be looking once you guys logged in. So here you can see previous uh, students, and uh, you have all the uh, pro projects, uh, all the um, uh, tasks assigned to you. You can go according to your path. You can solve it, and you can uh, submit the flag here itself. We'll get to know in the backend. Uh, how you have uh, like uh, whether you have solved it or not. So CTF project portal. Uh, here you can see uh, we have for SOC environment uh, bypasses for uh, offensive. Uh, strong is for again SOC environment. So we have different uh, uh, topics for different uh, path choosing people. So you can uh, solve go on solving uh, from our end. Uh, like we will support you for. If you are stuck anywhere, so this also we have. So lab, uh, we will be uh, helping you with installing VMware, installing uh, Kali Linux, configuring it for various attacks. Uh, where that guidance will be from Parrot. So if you guys are comfortable working with Parrot, you can work with Parrot. We'll help you for that as well. So here are like a Wireshark uh, screenshot from Metasploit. So autopsy. Uh, work out. So this is uh, security fabric for uh, network security issues for people who are using the path. So this is for NSE for certification. This is for this entire to topology we call it as security fabric. So apart from this, we'll be giving you resources on uh, CEH certification uh, pre recordings. We'll provide you. Uh, we'll give you the software necessary uh, recordings for all the. Uh, all the necessary tools, all the necessary parts recording will be provided to you uh, once you are registered for our program. So these are all the tools we will be providing you. Schedule classes will be every Monday, Wednesday and Friday. Timing is from 8.30 to 10.30 which we would have uh, uh, discussed. Uh, assignment and lab practice will be happening on Tuesdays, Thursdays and Saturdays. So based on the pro, uh, path you are choosing, it is going to vary. Monday, Wednesday and Friday will be for offensive. Uh, Tuesday, Thursday and Saturday will be uh, for uh, defense people. For attend, you, you guys have to switch and attend the classroom. So all the remaining day, you guys have to work on the uh, assignments which we, uh, we are giving. Uh, that, that will be hands on, not, not like the, we will give you some labs, you guys have to finish it. What's required, a uh, basic requirement, a laptop uh, or a PC with the 8 GB or 16 GB of RAM, uh, i5 or i7 processor, uh, a minimum is 500 uh, GB of uh, hard disk. If you are uh, having uh, more than that, it is well and good. A stable internet connection, uh, we will give you uh, 6 hours of uh, weekly training and uh, assignments and labs of uh, 8 hours weekly. 